Oh. He's speaking the truth. I can attest to that because gay gay males are the best friends for females because one we know you don't want to fuck us that's that's the first thing that's like it's out of our brains and you, we can really be friends with you so like and that's just the best friend to have to be honest. And it's the same. Oh, sorry. Go ahead. No, I was just saying for a girl to be honest. To be, to it's be it's the same thing on my side. Like I value I value all my friendships. I value my straight friendships with my my straight male friends because. It, it takes a little bit more for them to be comfortable, right? It shouldn't, but that's what it is. If you're really comfortable with yourself, you don't got a problem with me. And you're like, I'm, I'm not showing you shit in my phone. Like, that's not what we're doing. We're just regular. Like, at the end of the day, I'm still a man. So I should have my, my male friends, right? I think statements like how we started the show at the top of the episode, that's detrimental. Because now, now you're playing to see like, oh, he hangs with his friends, so now he's gay. So now I got this nigga questioning like, oh my God, what? what I can't be friends with you. Because what? Because I like what I like and you like what you like. You place that seed of doubt and now a weak friendship is going to be tested by that. I'm secure with mine. All of my friends that I know are secure with themselves. So we're good. But all that plays into it, like the situation. Yeah, but hold on, man. Unless y'all be unless y'all been friends from 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 like childhood, if a straight, if a straight I I, I find it kind of weird if a if a straight guys all like all of a sudden out of nowhere has this newfound relationship with a gay dude now i'm gonna start calling homie sus like nah homie nah something, <laughs> something but why? yo but why because p if, if yo you just met homie like fucking three four months ago and you know and everybody know homeboy gay what the fuck you doing over there with him knowing you've been with me for 40 years? <laughs> now, look, you got to stand on that same point y'all was on earlier because CP standing his ground and I was supposed to call him out. Now I got to call you out because it's the same argument. What's wrong with just hanging out? You Why know what's you? You knock the fuck off. You know what's wrong with that. Out of nowhere. What's wrong with it? What's, what's I don't wrong know. With the okay, let's break it down like this. Me and him been cool for years. We chilling. I might not know everybody he know, you know what I'm saying, all his other fucking friends, but let's say he come back home and then he 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 introduced me to some new cat. He like, yo, bub, yo, this my man from um from Houston. And I know this homeboy like he gay, or he's just he says he gay, he's sus. I'm gonna be like, yo, hand, bro. That ain't even your steez. That ain't your style. What you bringing him around us for? Fuck he gonna do with us. So what so, so let's say you come to DC, right? And we and we we rocking P pop up. What you what you what you processing? Nah, nah, because I know this ain't this this ain't like P P nothing nothing against you. You seem like a cool cat. I mean, you could be around for for a little while, but not for long. You ain't gonna be fucking hanging out all night with us. Why not? <laughs> sus. Why not? So are we? So you saying that make us sus? Hell yeah! The people, well, <laughs> the, perception, the outside perception. Uh, well, okay, but you don't feel that way. You just think other people will see you that way. Absolutely. Wow. Absolutely. Wow. Come on. Especially, uh, especially, so, especially our our type, our character. Fuck out of here, man. So everybody knows not gay though. That's like what, what I'm that's saying is speculation. Wow. And then and then that puts you in the tough. That puts you in a tight spot because this motherfucker start whispering, "Oh, yo, I saw a bug with blah blah blah, or I saw a hand with blah blah blah, or oh, it's gonna be a problem." My I, don't name so, them, I don't want none of them background conversations. My, my, name, rings bells, bells, my name rings bells, but not for the reason that you think. I'm at Hampton. We're all from Connecticut. Well, I'm from Connecticut. I'm at Hampton, DC. I met mm -hmm. him when I was in grad school. We didn't. I'm, we that from was the like 2015, 15, 14, one of them. Yeah. That's, we only go back that far. It's far now, but that's, that's my brother, right? Mm -hmm. I can go anywhere. Y'all, I'm here for the DJ. That is my friend. That is my brother. We are family. That's kind that's kind of different though. No, because you just said no, you, no. Yeah, no. This, no. that's his, his, that's his profession though. Of course he's gonna meet uh, 
different types of fucking humans because he in that crap. <laughs> yeah, it's gonna be a man. No, it don't matter how they meet, bud. Come on now. This is everyday life for everybody. Yo, let, me tell you, yo, let me tell you something. Let me tell you something right now. You see like a cool cat, but if I move down to DC, right? And me and you've been, I don't know, quote unquote, cool for like, I don't know, a month or two. You try to invite me out somewhere? Nah, that's out. Yeah. How many times have I ever invited you? Do I that's out. Club? Huh? Have you ever seen me at the gay club? No. Do I ever invite you to anything gay? No. <laughs> oh, wait, 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 wait. No. Hell no. Nah. <laughs> where I go, are there usually women? Prior to you being married, shout out to the wife. Prior to you being married, when we go out, am I not usually with women? Straight women, women, yeah. women. Yeah, we begin. Yeah, they. Yeah, they, I, 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 I'll be able to get a lot of access. So, what I'm hearing you say is you, you have a notion of what, what the gay person is, the gay cast member, right? Cool, that's mm -hmm. great. I got you. What I'm saying is contrary to your own opinion, I probably would give you more access than you would get on your own. <laughs> that's not anything against you or what, like whatever. You got that. I know you got it. <laughs> but let me ask you this though i would be new to the scene right no you your name ring bell nobody would know me but if i'm a new cat that you bringing around all your pins gonna be on the right? no but also i don't live for outside people because i don't give a fuck because none of y'all pay my bills can't none of y'all book my ass and i'm financially in secure in every way Love, you playing yourself. Gay dudes could fight for real. And I'm not, I'm not, I know that. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not saying that, Q. Saying. I'm not saying that. But like, come on now, you got to hear me out now. Like I said, I gave you a perfect example. I'm new to the area. Don't nobody know me. They only know P. Now I'm showing up and I'm a handsome motherfucker. Let's just get that out the way. Now, come on now. <laughs> They going they gonna be like, yo, who so and so that pee, that P breaking around? <laughs> who is that cat? <gasps> who is that cat with all that me frosty shit on? Who is so that you dude? So, you but what me? you're saying is the gay niggas gaydar would be broken, so therefore they don't identify that. You're not. not. I'm not saying mm. it would be broken. They would be curious. You think yeah. that? You think they that? Would, you think that? Know, you think gay people are very particular like they're yeah. not just fucking on everybody like they that's well, also, another I'm question like, guys, guys always feel like <laughs> guys are afraid of the gays because they don't want to be objectified like they objectify women they're so really? arrogant they all gay guys want them that's the thing don't. yeah there's many an ugly ass nigga that'd be like yeah you want me and don't let me count the why i don't <laughs> I got that. Hey, P, let me ask you a question, though. Uh, Mr. Fantastic kind of said it. I was kind of thinking it. Does he have, do you think, do you think that he has, do you think that he has a point at all, or do you think that nobody in there would think he was gay? I, I think there's a point. I'm not going to take away from the point. There is a point there. Mm -hmm. I think it it says more about a person as an individual if you let that deter you because you'll fuck around and and miss out on a genuine friendship a genuine brother like if you don't want one you don't want one that's cool you can't take that away from you either but you miss out if there's if the only thing that separates the difference between me and somebody you would hang out with is the fact that i like niggas cool that's on you both of our lives will still go on but that is the only difference i'm not bringing that around you if you bring that around your friends, like do, do y'all gang bang the girls, like I don't know how that works. I don't know how that works, but that's not how we work. That's not how I work. Now there there are ratchet, there are ratchet gays, there's ratchet everybody. I don't operate like that in my circle. That's not how I was brought up. Do you what happens? Let me ask you a question. What happens when so what's the allegation so let's say you see bub has a um, this is slightly hyperbolic but i'm using the terminology a visceral response for all intents and purposes when people when when let's say people that the entire community right 
the LGBTQ, whatever community, right? When they see somebody have a visceral response about homosexuality, what is the first thought? Is a thought like he just really ain't fucking with this shit, or is a thought like this nigga got something to hide, or neither? I, I think it's a combination of all three. Okay, you'll have a bucket. Of, you'll you'll have those that are like, oh, he's probably hiding something. You got those that are like myself, like that's on you. I don't really care as long as we have, we don't gotta fight. We're good. And you got the other ones that are like, I think not caring. Um, not caring and just being like, oh, okay, he don't fuck with it. Like, you don't fuck with it. Cool. Stay over there. We stay over there. But like, I'm not going to change the way I move based on you. You change the way you move. I'll take note of it. I'll put that right here because at some point you're going to come back around, right? Not like you're going to come back around. Somebody's going to ask about you, especially if you're new in a city, city where I've already been. Like, oh yeah. How, you know, so-and-so don't. The first thing I say, oh, he don't fuck with the gays. He good. He don't da 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 da. In a city like DC, and it's in a city like where where there's a lot of them, you you make or break your own success. You don't gotta be cool with everybody. You don't you don't gotta like the shit. But to see the reaction that you have, it's like oh damn, like we was we were literally just up here fucking laughing. And as soon as that came around, it was like nah, fuck that. Ooh, say less. <laughs> mm. so yeah, we... I, I gotta say, it'd come across like Bub don't really fuck with gay niggas. Um, not that he got something to hide. I think when the dudes we have a something to hide, mm -hmm. they're either a little bit too loud. Mm -hmm. But there's like I can't explain it. It just has to be the fact that mm -hmm. I'm gay, right? There's this undertone of flirtation that comes with it that I just cannot explain. But when they're like loud and like semi flirtatious with gay niggas, it's like, yeah, you're you're trying to hide something. Nothing about any statement that Bub has made so far would indicate that if he was like out in public and just saying what he was saying, he's saying that I'm like, but you can always tell you you would sniff them niggas up. Like, yeah, he as homophobic or just don't fuck with that gay shit the way he trying to make it seem. And it's so hard for me to explain it. It just have no. to be like one of those things where you just have to be there to see it. But you, so you would you would see it as like a cover up type shit, Q. If we just simplified it to understand it, mm, not a cover up on Buzz's part. No, 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 Jenna, no, no. Outside of him, outside of him, but just like the over over response. What do you when you're when you're yeah, it, the person that you're articulating? Like, go ahead, my bad. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. The cover up comes with something extra. It's like a little bit of more spice on it. I can't explain it. I feel like there's a scale of engagement to me anyway. It, like if, when you're in the interaction, you can tell by how engaged, of, you know, that straight, that straight man is and then how he's engaging. Like to Q's point, they're loud or they're extra in some kind of yeah. way that you just can't put your finger on, but they're mm -hmm. like, like you can tell when somebody can't fight. They're <laughs> extra. Yeah. They're like the loudest person in the, like, yeah, it's one of those kind of things. And you can't and, quite pinpoint it, but you just it's know. Always, it. It's always something extra. Like, all right, you made your, you don't fuck with it. But at every turn, well, look what this nigga doing. You don't fuck with it. Stop, <laughs> Stop fucking talking to me. Right, like, Buck would be the one to be like, all right, I don't fuck with that. I'm going to be on this side of the room. Whereas, like, the one who wants to really be engaged, they're going to be on that side of the room just talking shit. <laughs> I can't believe this nigga's still here. Right, but engaging though. <laughs> <laughs> or like, see, see what I'm saying? See, that nigga keeps sucking his teeth and all that. He keep he looking said. at my ass, nigga. Yeah, like he's like, so much <laughs> no, he's not. <laughs> now, don't get me wrong. Don't get me wrong, yo. I ain't going like. I don't think I could ever like turn my back on like a good friend that like came out like years later, like, and be like, yo, Bob, yo, I got something to tell you. Yo, I'm gay. I'll be like, what? But it depends on how, like, I ain't going to just, like, shun him, like, now that he, like, bro, that's your butt. That shit ain't mine. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I would just be like, yo, I, how, bro? How? We done did this, 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 how? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> how? But I wouldn't, I wouldn't, per se, turn my back on him. 
because of what he want to do in his own fucking bedroom but um I don't know. It, it, some uh, uh, some things would change though. Like as as far as like, yeah, I gotta know who else know. I I gotta I gotta know who else know, bro. And if we going somewhere, I got yo. What the fuck? Hey, what the fuck you taking me? I don't want to do no new shit. <laughs> like, but we still gonna be cool though. We still gonna be cool. But don't you ain't gonna be lying to me no fucking more. I got to yo. You got to tell me everything now. Fuck that. I got to know. You, you want to know everything? Well, I don't want to know everything, but <laughs> if we going to be out together in public, I need to know who else know because now they, yo. And the, and the shit that would really fuck your head up is y'all would go out and he would be the one like, that one, that one, that mm -hmm. one. Like, right. And when they start coming up and they, that, and they regular nigga shit, nothing, nothing that you would pick up if you didn't already know. It happens all the time. I promise you it happens all the time. Jesus Christ. <laughs> so the so Bub, do you think that the Gator thing is real? <laughs> Yo, it's a lot to take in right now. The way P the way P breaking that shit down, that shit might be motherfucking real, yo. <laughs> That shit might be real. Yo, I'm gonna keep it a buck. You think it's like more? Said, Cause like I said, if I ain't pick up on the shit in like 25, 28 years, but now PC, PC my man, and he'd be like, yo, Bob, your, your boy, I'll be like, yo, P, shut the fuck up, yo. We <laughs> have... gonna, yo, P would be like, yo, I'm left telling... Diddy's party too late. Yo, yo. <laughs> I will be hurt. Hurt. Damn, how many times has that happened? <clears throat> you be calling out niggas, man. And I'll be like, yo, shut the fuck up, nigga. Yo. That shit is not true, nigga. That shit is cr Yo, I can't do it, bro. <laughs> that shit is. And then, and then, and then I'll be talking to son that got called out, right? And they be talking. You know what I hear? Fucking Charlie Brown, nigga. <laughs> nigga talking to me. All I hear is... Nah, 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 nah. I'm like, yo. <laughs> wow. That's crazy, man. Like, share, subscribe. Tell a friend to tell a friend. Hit that like button right now if you can. That helps the channel the most. Let me see.